the play opens with Button, which has to do with a couple of workers who are doing the same task day in and day out. And they begin to question why they're doing this task and what happens if they don't do it. The second play is called Backing Out, and that's about a family who's trying to back out of the sister-in-law's driveway and having a very difficult time of it, but they're learning that maybe it doesn't matter where they are as long as they're together. The third play is Cocktail Party. That's actually one of the only ones that has been produced out elsewhere. It's a multi-award winning play, and it's about a gentleman who invites a... uh, business contact to a cocktail party filled with people who are a little less than animated. And the fourth play after our intermission is what's different. And that is a couple of people who haven't seen each other in a long time, trying to figure out what has changed with the other person. Uh, The fifth play is voiceover. And that is dealing with first dates and um, perhaps how an actor would go on a first date. And the final play is Goodbye Crew World. And that is a family is on a trip of a lifetime. I'd say the main reason people should come see Hello World is first and foremost, it's a fundraiser. We're trying to save the theaters in the North Hollywood Arts District. And As I mentioned, and we all know, it's been a really tough year and a few months and many of them have lost their spaces. Many of them are still hesitant to open and that's that's very understandable. So first and foremost, it's to help theaters as as much as we can. Secondly, it's just to remember that, you know, theater is a thing to experience and it's a place that we can go and, and be safe and with both our, you know, our emotions and our feelings and to uh, be able to express ourselves and to watch somebody else express ourselves. And I think the other big reason why people should go see Hello World is because these actors have worked very hard to bring something to life and they waited like a year and a half. This is more than a kid at Christmas time to be able to get back on stage and do their art. And the directors have just had probably visions bottled up for so long that they're now able to share on stage. And, you know, we writers are a little lucky because plague or no plague, we're always writing, we're always creating. And yes, we do want our stuff realized, but we're okay waiting a little bit, especially us writers who submit all the time. It might be years before something we wrote gets realized on stage, but actors, their, their job is to act and as great as Zoom has been as the filler, there's nothing better for them to be on stage doing their craft. And you can just tell from the reviews that we've gotten, these actors are just so happy to be back that the energy they're exuding is, is infectious. I'm Thomas J. Mizoraka, and if you would like to come see Hello World, A Night of My One Acts, come check us out at the Brickhouse Theater in North Hollywood.